the thing you calls up images of the glow of candlelight reflected off uh, the smooth surface of a mirror. A little bit like the Bing Shen in our previous video, but this light is gentler and more calming. A fierce ray of sunshine may cause you to flinch and shade your eyes, right? But the reflected light of the candle is mesmerizing and captivating. A telltale sign for a positive, attractive and exuberant personality. But make no bones about it, there is genius in this pillar. And that's why I have chosen Jack Ma as the representative of the Ting Yo Day Master. But before we get into all that, Welcome back as we continue our series exploring the 60 pillars. Thank you for watching. My name is Pauline Chang and I am a life coach and I use Chinese metaphysics in my coaching to empower, not to disempower. Okay, now while the reflected sunlight of the Bing Shen represents a powerful sense of purpose, uh, when translated to its yin counterpart, this image of the reflected candlelight, can you see it's reflected? There we go. Yeah. Okay, let me dance around the screen for you. Okay, so this image of the reflected candlelight signifies the Ting Yo Day Master's ability to view things from new or different perspectives. This is a rare and valuable gift that magnifies the Ting Fire's natural ability to inspire, influence, motivate, and enlighten. Because true inspiration and motivation can only happen when you are able to walk a mile in the other person's shoes. When they are convinced that you speak their language and truly appreciate the situation they are in. But make no mistake, there is nothing reticent about the thing, yo. Bright thing fire sitting on a shiny sin metal uh, results in a day master that loves the limelight and revels in being center stage. This is uh, an incredibly charismatic day master who exudes irresistible charm and enthusiastic confidence. Now let's talk about your strengths. Let me, so I'm blocking you a little. Okay, the thing your pillar sits on the rooster, which is both your knight noble, actually it's your nobleman star, as well as your intelligent star. So how about, how's that for two in one, right? So this gives you a strong sense of nobility. In Chinese metaphysics, the concept of nobility uh, talks about a person who has the resources to be of help to others, to be of service to others, and of course, seated on your own intelligence star means that uh, intelligence, knowledge and respect are par for the course. Okay, next, the day master. Persuasive and passionate, the thing fire is the only element that can truly transform all the others. Because of this, thing fire day masters tend to be typically open-minded. But more than that, the thing you, thanks again to your intelligence star, has the inborn ability to link different concepts and ideas together to create new insights or breakthroughs. That's your superpower and if that isn't genius, I don't know what is. Okay, number three, your sin metal wealth star is the foundation of your innovative can-do attitude. This Coupled with your gift of perspectives, gives you the ability to look at obstacles and setbacks from different angles. Additionally, you thrive on challenges, viewing them as opportunities to learn, improve and demonstrate your abilities. And finally, because of your Sin Metal Wealth star right here, okay, right here, you are never one to fall for the sunk cost fallacy. Instead, the thing you is far-sighted enough to abandon a struggling strategy in favor of developing new tactics to attack the problem from a brand new angle. What was that famous line again? I think Einstein said it. The definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, but expecting different results. Okay, but here comes the irony. Okay, the opposing forces represented by the thing fire and sin metal gives rise to a rather prominent streak of rebelliousness and fierce independence in the thing yo pillar. On the plus column, 
This means that the Ting Yu Dei Master is one who prefers to always be in control and will accept responsibility for your own actions. But on the negative column, you find it really hard to accept advice. So perhaps here's the most important message to the Ting Yu Dei Master when you learn to recognize and accept genuine support when it comes your way. That is when your Day Master truly shines. Okay? Now, how do you present? For all your sociable traits, the thing you can be a rather difficult pillar to analyze. Like the candle reflected in a mirror, what you project on the surface may not be what you truly are. No doubt, the thing you is infinitely attractive, but there is a fickle and restless quality that represents an idealist who is constantly chasing after new experiences. Instead of viewing this as a disadvantage, why not use the natural inclination of the thing you to learn new perspectives and open new doors by expanding your circle? After all, they're already flocking to you like moths to a candle. Okay, so now let's cut to thing you, but better for the thing you to shine. You need the freedom to pursue your intellectual curiosities without external in interferences. In other words, the thing you loathe being constrained. Remember, rebel, right? So after all, this is an independent pillar. You balk at restrictions and will tend to rebel when there is too much authority. So once given the room, you need to flex your creative muscles, you would be surprised to find that the thing you can achieve tremendous feats of laser-like concentration and endurance. Therefore, to be thing you but better requires you to make conscious choices in life that will give you the right environment or conditions to support you. You know, actually, come to think of it, that's what a Pazu Consult is all about, to help you craft that environment to help you to grow. Okay, so that's it for the thing, Mao. Thank you for, for watching. But before we go, uh, a final caveat. Without the ability to see the full chart, I must stress that these suggestions in this video are broad recommendations based on a single pillar only, which is the day pillar. Okay, uh, there are certain traits that can be transferred when we're talking about the year pillar, month or hour. Uh, but in general, this video is aimed at the day master only. So are you a Ting Mao day master? You can plot your Pazu chart from the free plotter link in the description. If you have a question, drop it in the comments, please. Otherwise, until I see you in the next video, help others gain a different perspective please help me share this video or at least just like and subscribe. Thank you guys. Goodbye.